what I'm holding in my hand is 3,000 bond which at some point was a two dollars that it became a dollar and then currently price at 50 cents that means half of a dollar but now that the Zimbabwean government has printed other notes called the ZIG what does this mean for this currency called the RTGS currently the combis are not taking this the value of the RTGS in the supermarket it's so bad it's decreased there's a tug of currency wars between the bank rate and the black market rate where the rate at which the one us dollar is priced at on the black market is six thousand let me tell you in the supermarket it then goes up to thirteen thousand or fifteen thousand there is a huge difference and, and these price fluctuations or these value fluctuations are caused by the black market but how does it work in zimbabwe how is it affecting the people of zimbabwe let's find out My African dream. In 2008, Zimbabwe experienced one of the most severe cases of hyperinflation in modern history. At the height of this hyperinflation crisis, the Zimbabwean government printed money to finance its budget deficits. One million dollar notes were printed, 100 million, 10 billion, 100 trillion, and even one quadrillion dollar notes were printed, whose value was only equivalent to a few US dollars. In response to this crisis, the government finally decided to abandon the Zim dollar as official currency. 2009, multi-currency systems were adopted and mainly the USD, South African Rand and Botswana Pula were used as official currencies. This stabilized the economy. Right now, these are not working in the streets of Zimbabwe, so they are as far as valueless. How much is it? 19,000. How much is it? dollars something. But you know, it's nothing to do with profit. It's not to do with bank. It is currently some minutes past eight and it's the work morning rush. People are right headed to work. People are rushing to work. <laughs> Bonus, but I'm afraid of being ridiculed because it has been over a week since people stopped using these so I don't know people's reactions towards it should I risk it should I not So then people are saying chicho gapata chicho jo for me just hold the views do not photo cop no go be go man na lo go go man why ai da le ba ya go na lo go go man serious ai da nda ha ba be tsino di do dai sira ga ma mo ah you know thing game really si ona ya ntina ya se ti ba no sorry ramba 
Despite having over 14 days until it is discontinued, the small to medium enterprises pioneered by the black market effect have completely faced out the RTGS dollar, leaving many in possession of the RTGS at loss. <laughs> <laughs> However, on the other hand, some businesses continue to operate in US dollars, which has proven reliable over the years. This is so nice. Hello. How much is the Pirica din? 55. Hey guys, so about the informal sector or those guys running small businesses, be it vendors, be it guys in the small market spaces have actually refused the board not to be used so now let's go to the supermarket and see how the pricing if it's in US dollars if it's in the zig dollar that's not readily available on the market or it's still priced at board not a heart speed to the city streets we begin to feel the fire we rise like tall buildings As the chemicals, they take us higher The night's young So this is 42 Zig, you guys Things like red seal rice, you guys, they are in the same dollar, which is quite okay. So most food prices, you guys, are in the same dollar, the zig dollar. So you need to have a calculator every time you want to buy something for you to be able to calculate. Okay. And there are any remote So I am in a street called Speak. This is what everything looks like. Those of you who know are rather where the food bridge starts that goes into Joiner City. I am headed towards NMB Joiner City because I need to file up a query with the transaction that I made with the bank. Uh, a brand started working with me last month. They made a payment into a bank account, but the funds have not gone through. It has been over a month now. So I printed out the transaction ID. I want to go and find out what really is the problem. Uh, could this be also another effect of the changes in currencies right here in Zimbabwe? Are the banks frozen? So let's just go there and find out. This is the famous food bridge that goes all the way into Joiner City. That's Joiner City. At some point, it was the tallest building in Zimbabwe. From up here, you're able to see the city. I'll show you guys when I get to the top. But yeah, I hope really this issue with my bank gets resolved because it has actually strained the relationship that I have with the brand. I might need to open another bank account if I have problems with this bank. Because I hear different banks have different policies as far as incoming foreign currency is concerned. From up here, you're able to see the rest of Harare. And it's so beautiful. Oh my God.
right here some months ago a shop burned down i really feel sorry for the people we had businesses there That is definitely the queue to the bank. So let's just try and go inside to see how we can get assistance. But the queue is just closed. I was told I can't be assisted immediately because I have to join the queue. Just like everyone else who's in the queue and that won't work. <laughs> Hey guys, I just I'm just from the bank and then the bank couldn't give me a knot because they have not received the funds. Ask them if they could give me a knot, but then they say they can't give me a knot. So I don't know. These are some of the challenges that we face with the banking system in Zimbabwe so I'm really worried about my brain because they won't believe me if I tell them that my bank could not give me a nod that the money has not been received yet how, how, how is banking in your country? kindly drop a comment and let me know and also like because I've worked for that money since last month I worked for that money last month and I'm waiting for that money and now I can't get it because it's somewhere hanging in the air I was advised the brand should just simply reverse those funds and send them again yes thank you guys